All right, we're back up here on the job site. We're getting these cages ready here for the uh, for the deck here. So I'm gonna walk it out with you guys, flip it around. These are the cages that we got done so far. Got about 20. Actually, we got about uh, we got about a total of 115 here. You'll see these orange marks on it here, and this is the part that we're gonna make an uh, extension overlap and it's going to go into the gray beam you'll see that a little later here we made these little hooks here just so when we lift up the uh, cages it can make it a little bit more efficient for us here are the rings for it we've got about 15 I think about 1500 to do a 15 16 foot cage four inches on center we got some dobies we got some uh, wd-40 some air we got these here, we're gonna try these out here for the rebar uh, cages, kind of go on the bottom of it so the uh, the cage can sit on it, giving you that three inch clearance. Let's we'll see how these work out. We got the dobies just in case they don't work out. Rebar tie wire. This here is our uh, little table to make our cages here. And you can see we kind of made the template here about four inches on center rings there the hooks to them going pretty efficient a lot of people say why don't you just make them have uh them make them but sometimes it's easier for us to make them here because of the holes uh, and so far it's beneficial for my guys to make them if it was in a super tight crunch i'd probably have them make them but while they're back here digging the holes, I had the guys starting to make them. And it'll be 33 of them. I have my son up here in another labor. If the guys get busy just making them, because it's not like we need them all at one time. We're kind of doing it, you know, in phases, I guess you'll call it. Um, here are the tie wire we done went through. I got a hundred rolls, so I think... We're gonna make it for 35 cages. And we got, how many ties do we have on each one? We got one, two, three, four, five, six. Six is 45 of them, so whatever that is, times 33. I'll put the calculations up there. Here are the piers that we drilled so far. We have 39 of them. Drilled. We gotta put about nine more for the swimming pool guys here. We gotta put some up there. I think in the back total we got about 52. Uh, on the plans they cost for 12 feet, but as with anything in construction, never goes as planned. Uh, they wanted them 14 feet. All right, we're back. Hope everyone's doing well, staying positive, hanging around people that are positive. As you can probably see here, I'm kind of doing these little vlog style videos now here, kind of out in the field real time. So I did forget the wind mic here. So if you guys heard some wind earlier, definitely apologize for that. We got about 115, maybe 120 piers. Average depth is about 16 feet, 18 inches in diameter. We are putting the cages together on site. I do get some questions as why you didn't use Bill Tech. They offer excellent service. Any contractors out, hit Stacy up. She'll take care of you. But I like to kind of do it in the field. We always have one or two laborers kind of lingering around so they can do it. We don't need them all at the same time. If it was a rush, or, uh, something we had to get done like tomorrow or yesterday, we definitely probably have Bill Tech build the uh, the cages. Other than that, it's pretty simple for us. We've made a little template here. Everything is four inches on center. Number three for our circles or stirrups as they're called. I prefer squares. Six number five verticals. They're about 16 feet each. We got to make a little uh, 
overlap with the hook that's going to go into the gray beam and i'll show you we have another video for that later so sit back relax enjoy the music again any questions any comments leave those down below hit the like button share all the youtube algorithm stuff definitely appreciate you guys let's get into the video let's continue with the video Right, as you can see it's kind of becoming muscle memory putting these cages together the guys kind of got a flow on how everything moves and so forth so it definitely um, helps that we know how to put these together now we did put we have put uh, peer cages together on other job sites I'll leave some links down below and I think we pretty much got the rhythm of putting these things together the only difference here is that we use circles uh, instead of squares normally with the squares we can kind of custom build them on site that's why you see the rebar bender out there but with these circles we did have to have them made it's a total of I think 15 1600 it's going to get us about 35 40 piers each circle is about three or four inches on center and we got five six number five verticals going throughout the cage so just want to jump in here real quick definitely appreciate you guys hanging around people that's positive it's cool to ask for help sacramento hit us up bay area hit us up all our information is below <laughs> 